Starting in 30 seconds. Hello fam, welcome to your 30 minutes of head to toe. I'm MRT and let's straight away get into the business. We're starting with some mobility exercises. Stand right under your hips and get your arm rotations on from forward to back and keep on going and doing that. Let's go. Three, two, and a one. And from the reverse, the movement, easy peasy. Good, perfect. Yeah, this is just 30 minutes, so we're cutting straight to the chase and not blabbering here and there, yeah? Cool, awesome. From there, opening your legs a little wider, we want to go side to side overhead reaches. Nice and easy. Come on, really stretch out overhead, opening up your spine, your joints, and from there, bring your hands center onto your waist. We're gonna go into hip rotations from right to left. Keep your knees really soft. Keep your feet turning over and out on the floor. Don't keep them stiff, otherwise the hip rotations won't come nice. Yeah, from there, from to the other side, left to right. Three, four, five, last one, and six, perfect. From there, just get your feet together and just give me very soft jogs on the spot. Just like that. Just activating your body, articulating your ankles. Be very soft on the ball of your feet. Cool? Awesome. Nice. From here on, we're going to straight away go into a warm-up. We're going to go into warm-up. Everything is 40, 40 seconds each. Yeah. We're going to starting with inchworm. That's the first exercise we are doing today. So you come to one side of the mat. You're going to go into that deep, deep down bend your knees quad. Walk across the mat, come into this high plank position. Make sure your core is tucked in, your navel's sticking to your spine and going back and extending and standing up. And we do this for 40 seconds on the clock in three, in two, and in one. Keep on going, nice and easy. Hold that plank, come back and stand straight up. Good, nice and easy. Make sure your wrist is right under your shoulders all the time and keep on breathing, yeah? Keep that steady pace of breathing. Nice and easy. We're going, going, and going. Good. Breathe. Nice. And five more seconds to go. Last two, and last one, and we are done. Good. From there, the second warm-up that we're gonna do is your jumping jacks two step out taps. So what we're gonna do is you'll give me two jumping jacks, which is you're gonna jump out and jump in. At the same time as you jump out, your arms are gonna swing up and come down where the feet come in together. From there, you do that, do that two times. From there, you're gonna step out, tap that toe, come back center, tap that toe on the other side, come back center. So right leg moves out, you bend that knee, lean onto that knee, tap it, come back out, lean on that knee, tap it, and come back up. Cool, that's all we do for the next 40 seconds. Let's start this in three, in two, and in one. Nice and easy. Be very gentle, yeah, with those hops. Don't land on your heels, just on the ball of your feet. And keep breathing in and breathing out. Nice. Come on, come on, feel as light as a feather. Go. Nice, perfect. Full range of motion of your arms. Arms swinging up and down all the way. Last three, last two, and last one. Nice and easy. From there, we're gonna go into something called as glued bridges. I want you to lie down on the floor, come to this base position. This will be from now on called base position, okay? So, feet, shoulder, shoulders? 
feet, hips, and shoulders in one straight line. Relax your body on the floor. You're gonna activate your core. Tuck that pelvis in, and then raise that hip up towards the ceiling, pelvis up towards the ceiling, and bring it down slowly. And you keep repeating that on and on for 40 seconds. Let's go in three, in two, and in one. Good, perfect. Calm yourself down here, just focusing on the pelvis, on your glutes. Only breathing in to go up and breathing out to go down. Nice. Tucking that pelvis in, going up and coming down. Make sure your knees are not moving too much. They're hip distance apart. Nice and easy, keep on going. Last five, four, three, two, and one, and relax. Cool, okay, awesome. If you guys are doing the workout, let us know in the comments down below which workout is your favorite, yeah? Which exercise that you do today, which one is your favorite that we, you have done today, yeah? So I need to know that. Otherwise, you can also tell us, oh, I don't like this workout, please change it. We will, next time, we'll change it, okay? Cool, from there. Let's get into the actual exercises. We are starting with squat with pulses. Uh, your feet are under your shoulder. Toes are pointing outwards. Heels are pointing in. Your knees will drive where the toes are and don't keep in. And from there, the hips will go back and down and your back will stay long and strong. Breathe in at a up top position. Go down, come up, tuck your pelvis in and breathe out. We keep on doing that for the next 40 seconds. Yeah, but at the same time in between, you'll give me a squat, give me one pulse and come up. Squat, one pulse and come up. Let's start that in three, in two and in one. Pulse and up, good. And up, keep on going. Nice and easy. We, got, we keep on going with exercises until eight and then we repeat it from the top, yeah? Good, nice and easy, breathe in, go down, breathe out, come up. Perfect, knees facing out, not caving in. Backs long, chest up, chest not dropping down. Last three, last two, and last one, and relax. Good, good, good. And from there, we're gonna go into shoulder taps. What you wanna do is you're gonna come down to this Plank position, get your feet a little knot together, a little outside, a little wider, and from there just tapping your shoulder one by one without too much movement in your hip. That's all we do, okay? Easy peasy, making sure your shoulders are stable and you're balancing yourself. Can we do that? Can we start that? In three, in two, and in one. Let's go, good. Perfect, keep breathing in and out. Stabilize yourself. If this is far too challenging for you, just get your knees on the floor, making sure your pelvis is still tucked in and not tucked out. Yeah, pelvis tucked in and keep on going and doing that. Nice and easy. Perfect. Breathing in and breathing out. Make sure your weight is equally distributed in your, on to your fingers as well. Yeah, not only just on your wrist. Last three, last two, and last one, and we are done. Okay, from there, the next exercise that we go and do is alternate lunges, alternate reverse lunges. Uh, you'll come on up top of your mat. What you'll do is just take one leg at a time behind and go into that deep, deep lunge, deep lunge, where your knees are almost touching the floor, but not on the floor, and that back heel is tucked in. Your knee or the front leg is over the ankle, your back straight and not rounding and core is engaged. You're gonna push on the front leg and come back center up top. You're gonna repeat that on the other leg and push on the front leg, come up top. We repeat that for 40 seconds. Let's start that in three, in two, and in one. Good. Nice. Pelvis tucked in. Core engaged. Balance yourself. If that is too difficult right now, you can find a wall, find a wall nearby you and keep on going, yeah? Hold that wall, try to find that balance, yeah? Cool, awesome. 
Breathe in, breathe out. Nice and easy, nice and easy. Good, good, good. And last one, and we are done. Good, from there. Favorite. Yeah, we are here at Box Switch. What is an exercise without throwing some punches? Yeah, so that's what we're gonna do right now. I want you to come into this guard position where your hands are fisted and they're right next to your cheek. Elbows are in, okay? Elbows are not away, elbows are in. What you'll just add here is, of course, the punches. Left, right, left, right, left, right. Punches across, straight punches. What you'll add is just fast feet on the floor at the same spot. You keep on running and you keep on throwing those punches at me on my face, okay? Let's start that in three, in two, and in one. Go, go, go. Each punch comes with an explosive breath out, yeah? Yes, that, like that. Keep on going. Do not lock your elbows. Extend those punches from your shoulders. Keep on going, keep on going. Legs moving. Nice. Go, go, go. Punch away. Nice and easy. Last two and last one. And perfect. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Okay, from there, next exercise that we do is wide squat to side to side crunches. I want you to come into this wide squat stance, sumo squat stance. Your toes are facing outwards, your heels are facing inwards. Knees are tracing over your toes. And that's what you do, yeah? You're gonna come down, squat, deep squat, come up, making sure your glutes are engaged. Squeeze together, squeeze those booties together, yeah? And come up, really engage your core. This time, keep your hands behind your head. You're gonna go sumo squat down from there. Tap your right elbow to the right knee, left elbow to the left knee, come center, come up. Sumo squat, right, left, center, come up. You're starting in three, in two, and in one. Nice and easy. Yeah, you can always comment down below. Yeah, we'll be more than happy to reply and to help you with if you have any queries, yeah, any feedback. As long as you are doing the exercises with us, along with us, is okay, yeah? Good. Nice and easy. Keep on going, going. Perfect. Breathe. Last three, last two, and last one. And center, and release. Good, nice, from there. We're gonna go into the most toughest exercise, yeah? But we'll try to make it a little, little easy. So what we wanna do is, you know, this is your push-up to knee tucks, okay? So uh, we have divided, so we are not continuously doing push-ups, so it is not that hard on the body right now. So what we'll do is, come into this regular plank position, make sure the elbows are riding back as you do a push-up, come back up, tuck that knee in twice, right and left, come back center, Give me a push up, come up, knee tuck, knee tuck. Good? Okay, if that is too difficult, you can keep your knees down on the floor. Give me a push up there, come back up, knee tuck, knee tuck, drop your knees, push up, come up, and knee tuck, and knee tuck. Kill, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. In three, in two, and in one. Go, 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 perfect. Making sure your hips are not dipping low down, yeah? You are in that plank position, either that or in your knee kneeling position. Good. Nice and easy. Go slow, it's okay. Listen to your body. Last two. And last one. Perfect, perfect, amazing, amazing, amazing. Okay, from there, we have two more exercises before I give you a short break and then repeat everything else. We are going to side lunge to lat pull downs. What will happen here is, you stand in center of your yoga mat, you're gonna step out on the right leg, bend that right knee. 
As you do that, your hands are over your head. You have to pull your elbows together, making sure your scapulas, your shoulder blades are pinching together. Come back up onto the other side. Making sure your back is long, your back is long and not curved down, yeah? Back is long and keep on doing that. Let's start that in three, in two, and in one. The knees are over your ankles and toes. Keep on going, nice and slow, steady. Really stretch that leg, which is stay static on the floor, yeah? Perfect. Nice and easy. Breathe in, breathe out. Good, good, good. Almost there, guys, almost there. Last one, and we are done. Good. Favorite workout coming next, crunches. We come back to this base position. Knees, hip distance apart. Heels, sorry, feet, hips, and shoulder in one that line. You're gonna, you're gonna activate your core. Make sure your lower back is pasted on the floor. You're gonna take a deep breath out and bring your shoulders up off the floor using your abs muscle and not doing these neck crunches. That's what you don't want, okay? Just coming up through your ab muscles. Let's start that in three, in two, and in one. Good, nice and easy. Very regular crunches, yeah? Keep breathing out as you do so. Breathe out, coming up each time. Lower back, never leaving the floor. Keep them pasted. Perfect, nice and easy. Almost there, guys, almost there. Go, go, go. Last five, four, three, two, one. Amazing. Nice. Come on. You can smile on. This is your short break. We take a 30 seconds break and repeat every single thing that we did just right now. Okay? We're going to start with what? Squat with pulses. Yeah? Let's do that. Are we ready? Have you recovered? Take 10 more seconds. We just start that, yeah? We go back to back without me talking too much this time, okay? We just listen to the cues and start. We're starting in three, in two, and one. Squat with pulses. Pulse down and up. Knees out, knees facing out, hips down low, back strong and long. Core engaged, breathe in, go down. Come up, breathe out, tuck your pelvis in. Keep on going, nice and easy. Yeah, come on. Perfect, perfect. Just sitting, guys. This action is just sitting down and coming up. Nothing else. Yeah. No extra and special information there. Last three, last two, and last one. Going to shoulder tap. In three, in two, and in one. Making sure you hold that plank position, your elbow pits are facing ahead. If that's too challenging, you always can come onto your kneeling plank position and give me those shoulder taps, yeah? Focusing in, trying to balance your body, core engaged, do not let go of that core, yeah? Core engaged, nice and easy, perfect. Breathe in, breathe out. Making sure that wrist is always under your shoulder. Last two. And last one. Going into alternate reverse lunges. In three, in two, and in one. Take that deep, deep step back. Go as low as you can go. Keep that pelvis tucked in. Push the front leg to come up. Yeah, shift your weight onto the front leg to come up and stand tall. Good, nice and easy. I've told you, if you want to balance, you can hold a wall and do those lunges, yeah? Good. Nice and easy. Keep on going. Front knee over the ankle and not going ahead. No, 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 yeah? Keep on going. Last three. 
Last two. And last one. Special punches coming through. Box switch classes. Without punches, there's nothing. In three, in two, and in one. Go, go, go. Punching right at my face. Yeah, nothing else. Keep on going. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Do not open your elbows. Keep those elbows down, facing down. Keep on going. Go, go, go. No stopping. You guys are doing awesome. Go. Perfect. Go. Nice. Last three. Last two. And last one. Easy, easy. Yeah, easy calorie burning. Let's go. From there, we're going to go into wide squat, side to side crunches. Toes out, heels in, wide squat. Let's start in three, in two, and in song. One, let's go. Good, nice and easy. Up. Go down, side to side. Keep on going. Nice and easy. Knees over your toes. Yeah, knees not falling down, down, down. No, no, no. Good, perfect. Deepest quad possible. Perfect. Almost there, guys. Almost there. Last five. Four. Three. Two. Give me last one. And done, done, done. From there, going to push up to knee tucks. You can always do those push up in that kneeling position or in that high plank. Let's start that in three, in two, and in one. Good. Making sure the elbows are riding right close to your body and not away from you, yeah? Keep on going. Nice. Almost there, guys. Almost there. You know that, right? You can always do a kneeling push-up. Yeah, like so. Good. Nice. And last one. And we are done. Okay, from there. Side lunges to lat pull-downs. In three, in two, and in one. Shoulder blades pinching together. Leaning front, keeping your back long and strong. Hinging that hip out, out, out. Go. Feel your inner thigh stretching of this leg. Good. Of the leg that is static. Nice and easy work. Just 30 minutes of your time, guys, in the entire day. That's all you need. Let's go. Last three. Last two. Last one. Going into the last exercise. Crunches in three. In two, and in one. Go, go, go. Keep on going. Crunches up. Perfect, perfect. Good. Nice and easy. Amazing. Keep on breathing in and breathing out. Nice. Go, go, go. Come on, wherever you're doing this right now, just smile through it, yeah? And last one, and we are done, done, done. Good, good, good. Take a quick 20 seconds break. Have a sip of water if you feel like. We're gonna do one last thing, yeah? It's a challenge. We'll do one last thing just for a minute. Oh, yeah, we're gonna be going and doing a hold, yeah? A plank hold for next one minute. That's it. Yeah, supercharging our core. And then we relax and cool down. Take a break, take a break. Cool, I want you to come down into this elbow plank hold and hold that here. Really, really low. The hips doesn't come up. The hips don't go down. They are in one line, the shoulder, your knees and your heels. Okay, just right there, tuck your pelvis in. We're starting and doing this for one minute. In three, 
in two, and in one. Let's go, go, go. Hit it. Good. Nice. I need to know in the comments down below if you guys held this for one minute or not, yeah? Even if you held this for 40 seconds, 45 seconds, put that information down in the comments down below, okay? Yeah? So you know that today you did so many seconds, and when you come back again and do a few more classes, you can see the change, yeah? Very, very soon. That you'll be able to hold it for at least one minute. And hold it and stay. Perfect. 30 more seconds. Breathe easy. Almost there. Almost there. Breathe. Last 15. Come on, people. Easy does it, yeah? Last three, last two, and last one, and relax. Great, great, great. With that, we have come to the end of today's session. Yeah, and what we have yet, sorry, sorry, my bad. What we are left to do is just cool down. Yeah, we really, really want to cool down because we have worked so much in past, past minutes that your body will be tired, so it needs a little cool down, so your muscles are not sore the next day, and we reduce our chances of injuries, okay? You're gonna lie down on the floor, back on the floor, hands over your head, legs in front of you, both hands stretching, reaching away from each other, legs and hands, torso separating from the legs, and stay there, breathe easy, breathe in, nice, perfect, three, two and a one and from there hugging both your knees close to your chest and pulse that in very easy keep on pulsing keep on pulsing nice and easy three two and a one release your hands next to your body knee stays there and dropping your knees to the left side very gently and keeping those knees there look at your right palm hold it let your body twist and relax and stretch and gently come back center and towards the other side Center, nice. Okay, let go of your left leg and hold that right knee close to your chest. Perfect, good, good, nice. And change that. Your other side. Left knee in close to your chest. Hold it. Hug close to your body. And release that. And gently flipping over to your belly. You'll give me a nice cobra stretch. Hands right next to your shoulders. Feet pasted on the floor, pelvis on the floor. Take a deep breath in. Raising your head up, shoulders down, jaw relaxed. Feel those abs stretching, your spine stretching and hold it there. Nice. Breathe. Perfect. And gently coming down. Good, nice and easy. Trying to grab hold of your ankles. Both the ankles. And stretch there, stay there and stretch. Do nothing, just stretch. Pulling your heels close to your hips, as close as it can get. And release them. Pushing your hips onto the belly and stay there. Sorry, hips on to your heels. Stay in child's pose. And gently rolling up. Gently rolling up, still sitting on your hips. Stretch your shoulders side to side. Nice, perfect. Breathe in, breathe out. Keep on doing that. And overhead stretch. Perfect. Come on, guys. Everybody, give me a nice smile. Yeah? You guys did that. 30 minutes 
of HHO exercise. I hope you guys had super, super fun. Yeah, I'm gonna see you real soon next week. Until then, you guys keep on grooving and keep on moving. This is me, MRG, saying bye. Captain, they got us a quick chance, so we like them.